Welcome to the Amsterdam series. So far in Amsterdam, we've gone full tourist mode, indulging in brownies and brothels. But there is so much more to this beautiful Dutch city. So come along in this adventure as we sail through the canals and we visit Anne Frank's house. Good morning, guys. It is our final day in the dam. It's another wet one. So we have to go get our final Corona test for this trip. We are going to drop some stuff off to Tony. And then we're gonna say goodbye to the bicycles. And I cannot wait to say goodbye to Ozzy the bicycle. That's a lie. It is not a lie. I keep falling off the bike. We named him Ozzy Osborne because he's unpredictable. Okay, I have like no voice left. Let's go get a test. All right guys, so I didn't vlog our final COVID test because well, it's boring and we're all sick and tired of dealing with COVID. So let's skip forward to us cycling through the gorgeous Rijksmuseum. Just said bye to Tony and Marika and now we are going to go get some breakfast because we are absolutely Marvin just trying to figure out if our certificates have come through for the Covid and then we're going to hit the road. We stopped in this lovely cafe for some tea, smoothies and toasties and then we said our final farewell to the bikes. Bye Ozzy. That's the end of mine and Aussie's relationship. Let's go do a canal cruise. I hear you at the door, feet hit the floor. I come running right into your arms till summer's gone. Oh, I'm trying, but I will find you. To see just in time to bring you right back to me Cause I miss you more than you will ever know So come back home We had to come here twice. We are back at Winko. Just I'm obsessed with this cake. Yeah, it's really good. We're gonna devour this because we have to go to Anne Frank's house after. Inside this building behind a secret annex is where Anne Frank, her family, the Van Pels and Fritz Pfeffer hid for two years during the Nazi invasion of the Netherlands. After the Bible, Anne Frank's diary is the most read book in the world and has been translated into 60 languages. I want to go on living even after my death, and therefore I am grateful to God for giving me this gift, this possibility of developing myself and of writing, of expressing all that is in me. I can shake off everything if I write. My sorrows disappear, my courage is reborn. But, and this is the great question, will I ever be able to write anything great? Will I ever become a journalist or a writer? I hope so. Oh, I hope so very much. Anne's wish came true, and although she never lived to see her 16th birthday, she is one of the most influential writers of our time. Unfortunately, towards the end of the war, the Gestapo discovered the secret annex, and everyone was sent to concentration camps. Anne's father, Otto, was the only survivor. All right, guys, so that was Anne Frank's house. Uh, tickets sell out well in advance, so if you're planning on going, book at least six weeks beforehand. Uh, you're not allowed to take any photos inside, um, no flash photography or anything like that. It's really sad, but it's absolutely, it's amazing how they've kept it intact, like they kept like parts of the walls and everything, so definitely would recommend it. Alright guys, so that's going to be it for this video because we are absolutely knackered. So we are, we've done about like 40,000 steps, something like that, we've done it today in about steps. So, we have our final meal, eat this, pack, fill in all our forms for the whole Covid situation. So if you've made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. For more travel content, be sure to smash that subscribe button and I will see you in the next one. Bye. Love, 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 love.